attempting to get a Oh man, is this really the shot? I was told, there he is! The perspective. We're all trying to get the same shot of his face. See how difficult this is? You know, and then we're all trying to yell, yell um, questions. David, where are you? You want my spot? David, I got a spot right here. Come on. Come here. Right in here. Cut. Get in. Get in. Perfect spot. Drop waves. You need a shot. Hey! I'm having a lot of fun here, everybody. Why do you keep getting in the way? Come on. <laughs> Did you order anything yourself? Oh, you're going to take plenty? The president, how much are you getting paid? How much are you getting paid? <laughs> you need to raise the minimum wage? I want more money. You think the minimum wage? I'll tell you what, it's a great franchise, it's a great company, and they've been very, very nice. And, uh, and come on, you know, if, if you look at really what's happening, look at the crowd over there, look how happy everybody is. They're happy because they want hope. They need hope. And that's what we're doing, that's what we're going to give much more than hope. What does Mr. working the fryer tell you about the people of Pennsylvania? You actually have worked at McDonald's now versus... Uh, now I have worked at McDonald's. I've now worked for 15 minutes more than Kamala. Are oh, you going to put this on your resume? I've never worked here. Why I've would she lie about something like that? What we put on your resume? I worked at McDonald's. Why would she lie about that? Why? Because she's lying Kamala. That's why. Why would she lie? Will you accept the results of the 2024 election regardless of the outcome? Will you debate her again? Let's not talk about that. It's an amazing business, it's an amazing country, and we're going to make America greater than ever before. We're going to do it. Okay. Are you going to see Aaron Rock? Look at the enthusiasm. I mean, that's thousands of people over there. They go miles back. That's incredible. So, uh, Are you going to move Aaron Rodgers? Sir, what's your lunch order? Tell us about getting started in your own career, Mr. President. How did you tell, tell us about those jobs that people take early on to try to make a break and how you did it? It's a great job to take it. It requires uh, expertise. I'm going through the French fries conference <laughs> at home. What have you learned? Did you learn anything new? And it requires great expertise, actually. 
Do you appreciate McDonald's more? Is it hot? Is it dangerous? McDonald's more now. Ali he said his order was going to be a, a fry, a plain fry. What do you think of Pennsylvanians? Mr. President, are you going to the Trump store? It's around the corner. It's about two miles down. They have a Trump store. Yes, sir. Right I'd in Ben Salem. I don't know if, if Secret Service can work it out. I'd it. It's right what? down about two miles down on the right. <laughs> If any of you guys have questions you want me to ask, I can try to ask him. Are you keeping the uniform? Secret Service can do it, I'm doing it. I like the idea. What's your takeout order? What's your takeout order? I don't know. What do you want? You want something? What yeah, you could you get me some? French fries. French fries. How about if we gave you some French fries? There right? you go. Are you a, that's sort of a bribe, but I think a bribe <laughs> for a buck is okay, right? I'm going to get you some French fries. Somebody come up here and take it. Are you keeping the uniform? <laughs> Listen, I always got to ask about the fashion. Olivia, Olivia. Yep. Hey, hey. Local. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. Thank you. Sorry. He's going. He's going. Local. I'm going to the fries. Okay, I'm going to help you. <laughs> You can see small ones, I'm going to large. You're going to hand them up or hold on, John, while you're talking? I'm not exactly sure. It's a game day decision. And it's game day? It must be game day. I wonder if the ice cream machine There you go. Here you go. Here you go. All right, thank you. Why do you have them in there for you? Okay. All right, thanks. You want to move them back? Yeah, you have uh, sure. Here. Sure. What do you okay. think? This one moves the needle for you. Sorry. I don't know. I'm doing very well. We're leading by quite a bit. Uh, she has no fracking. She's never, never. Uh, <laughs> she's going to have no fracking. That's going to cost Pennsylvania 500,000 jobs, and the revenues uh, untold. How do you connect festival? I think just by being myself. I want to be myself. All I want to do is be myself. They know what they have me at the best years, which they were thinking they would think we beat ISIS in literally uh, record time, very quickly and decisively, and uh, we did a great job. But we had the greatest economy ever, we had the best order ever. Being conciliatory Get it. Get it. versus confrontational, how do you separate that out in your life? Well, I always like to be conciliatory, but sometimes confrontation is important. And as an example, when you negotiate with other countries, when they've been ripping you off for years, because our country has been ripped off for years and years with with uh, other countries and by other countries, even our friends. And we've changed a lot of those trade deals and we're gonna change the rest, but we're gonna bring we're gonna bring jobs back to our country. Other Either way will you accept the results of the election? Yeah sure. If it's a fair election, of course. I would always accept it if it's a it's okay. fair election. We're leading in all the polls now, we're leading in every swing state and we're doing Close. well and it's uh, no I don't think so. I don't think so. In fact they just had an R C P said we were 93.2% chance of winning. I think that's pretty good. That's so a good we'll odds. see. We'll see. Those are pretty good odds. I like that. I like that. I'll take that yeah. right now. Yeah. All right. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. What's the yes, sir. Sir. Um, Hi. Who are you with? I am, I'm Eva. I'm with CBS Philadelphia. CBS. Um, are they the ones that did 60 Minutes? Yes. Yes. Are they the ones that changed her answer to make it positive? Uh, I'm not with network. I'm local. Well, it's the same yeah. thing. <laughs> so, uh, well, we actually aren't the same thing, but... 
When some people say that Harris might be more unifying, what is- Unifying, I think she's the most divisive person I've ever seen. How so? And she lies about her uh, job applications and she, she's, uh, she's told some horrible lies, but she's a very divisive person. And I think it shows up in the polls, yeah. I think I'm the one that brings everyone together. We had the greatest economy we've ever had. We had the best job numbers ever. Uh, we had the best border ever. The Border Patrol, by the way, for those that haven't heard, the Border Patrol a couple of days ago gave us their complete and total endorsement. They said Trump was the best president we've ever had, and they said she was the worst we've ever seen at the border. She did the job she did on the border, and that really breaks our country apart. Why'd you come to Bucks allowed, County today? They allowed, they allowed so many people into the country, 21 million people, uh, 13,000 of which were murderers released from prisons all over the world. We can't have that. Thank you all very much for coming. Thank you very much. Here you go. Thank you. 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 Including the hashtag for the rest of the time I remember. 10 billion views. Of course. TikTok Jack. What would Bibi call for? Actually, it's become very, uh, very famous. Yeah, Bibi called me this morning. And he's obviously got things going well. Goodness gracious. Is he, 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 he running a plan by you? I think he likes to hear what I have to say. Did y'all vote this morning or yesterday morning? Uh, yesterday morning. And he's going to hold off on Iran? A couple of days before that. He's going to hold off on Iran or what kind of, how is he going to hit him I can't tell you that. That I can't tell you. Uh, it, would, it would be very inappropriate, uh, but uh, they're certainly in a better position. And fortunately, they didn't listen to Biden and to Harris. You know who Harris is, right? Kamala. Today's her birthday. Uh, they wanted to, they didn't want him to do this. And you know, Israel is much safer now than it would have been if they had done it. So they, they did not listen to Biden or Harris. Thank you for the Thank prize. Well, I think this, I think these people work hard, they're great, and I just saw something, a process that's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing to see. These are great franchises and produce a lot Tommy, of Tommy, thank you so much. Great people working here, too. But wait, 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 did you get her some fries? I think I'll get her some flowers. Why not the bakery? Maybe guys? I'll get her some fries. You're right. That might be. I'll give her, give her some McDonald's. I'll get her a McDonald's hamburger. Thank you. No, it is her birthday. It is true, yeah. right? I, I saw Happy birthday, Happy birthday, Kamala. Happy birthday. See you later. Bye. Thank you, everybody. Thanks, Mr. Trump. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Trump. Thank you very much, 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 Mr. Trump. Oh man, is this really the shot? I was told, there he is! Okay, so here is the perspective. We're all trying to get the same shot of his face. See how difficult this is? You know, and then we're all trying to yell, yell um, questions.
David, where are you? You want my spot? David, I got a spot right here. Come on.